Welcome to my custom interloper run. I'm Nefo29, and here's what's in our backpack. We're a little underweight. Uh, we have stuff that we don't really need on us. Like, at this point, I don't know that we need the wood. Um, I'm probably going to take those. Uh, clothing's okay, for the most part. We got a little bit of meat on us. We got a bunch of water. Uh... That, I'm going to take to the medical facility and leave it. Our bows are getting low. Uh, we'll ditch the blue flares. We'll take the noisemakers. Uh, we have two of these. One of these is going to get left behind. Actually, it'll be that one. Uh, we have this. It's 1% cured because I literally dropped it on the floor and picked it back up. <laughs> So we are on day 223, and here's our skills. Rifle is getting close to four. And there we go. And we are approaching midday. Uh, so I don't have anything on the floor in here. Everything is gone. There never was actually anything, to be honest. Let's go this way. Today's word is a little bit of a long word. You don't think it's a difficult one. It's just long and themed around today. Yeah, today is Halloween. Where I live. I know some countries don't celebrate Halloween. But mine does. I like it. It's fun. Alright, let's, uh, where are you? You are 91. Get rid of you. Make sure that we have the other one. Uh, you. Well, it ain't as close as I was hoping, but close enough. What's in here? Okay, just that. And that's all of my stuff. Hmm. I can well, barely walk with this much gear. I really don't like these books being here. Oh, damn it. <laughs> of all the things. Oh, I have one of those too. I have like 85 books down here. And the one thing I click on and ruined everything. There it is. You know what? You can just stay. Uh, you know what else? Where is it? You can join your buddies. Uh, all right, you were gonna go. Oh, damn it. Well, we got to go inside the medical building to, uh, Determine what we're going to do with the hides. Are we going to take any of them or are we going to leave them all? I think we might just leave them all. I uh, will leave those. Um, this is all raw meat. The hunting knife is 90. You are 78. And we got cans there. I might take you. You're useless out here. Make sure you guys are empty. You're empty. I can give this another double check. All right, let's go. Hey, Billy Wilson, welcome in. Once again, Nifo is in prison. Yeah. We're gonna go in here. We'll drop the sapling, we'll drop the uh, the bedroll, the bad one. Okay, you're cured now. Let's leave you there. A bow is like five hours, isn't it? 
You know I'm not going to find it. If I do this... Where are you? There it is. Five hours. Yeah, I don't want to do that. That's pretty much the end of the day. Uh, moose hides 89. All right, let's uh, dump you off. All these blue flares can go in here. Look at all the noisemakers. And that's everything in there. Okay. Uh, what's our jerry can? Or our lantern? I wonder if I should leave some matches. 0.36 worth of matches. I'm not gonna, because you know what? Uh, the likelihood of us actually coming back here in this run is very slim, I think. We're getting near the end of this run, I think. We're at 15. There's another one. It's cured. Okay. Uh, what is our travel at? 93. Okay. We're not gonna do that. I'm gonna take two cured guts. And one of those. Alright, I'm just gonna have a peek through here and see if there's anything I really don't need. I need more meat. That's something I need. Uh, I don't really need the wires, to be honest. But we'll take them. It would be nice to have the ability to make a carry pie. Just to help out with our weight, but... Oh well. Now you're bare. You're not even cooked. Okay. Let's take three of those. Let's go. This pack is getting too heavy to carry. All right. Uh, where is it again? We are going to throw all of that, all of that. Throw that. Uh, what the hell? Let's throw that. We're not going to need it right away. shafts that's them right there 0.77 does this sound like something's walking oh I have 13 of that I could have probably left some of it That was a weird sensation because while I was in there, it sounded like something was taking footsteps. And it wasn't us. Oh, we got a, a boost of power there for some reason. All right, so we are basically heading out. I believe we're done here. Uh, our days in Blackrock. Seven. Works. 
I'm okay with it. I'm not sure what the Timberwolf situation is going to be like today. But we've been dealing with them pretty good for the most part. So I'm not too worried. That it was always my biggest fear was dealing with Timberwolves with the bow, but I've done it now a few times. And mostly it's gone well. There's been a couple times where it was pretty sketchy, especially the, the first pack that we encountered uh, in Sundered Pass. When I didn't really know anything about the region and I went in there and they handed my butt to me. But overall, I think I've been doing all right with it. I'm not nearly as bothered by it as I used to be. Yes, mostly you've done rather well. Sometimes you dealt with them excellently and a few times have had been have been bad. Yeah, this it it really depends on where you are. Where you get caught. And if you're able to get to a safe spot or at the very least a narrow area where they can't surround you. Once they surround you, you're in trouble. And in this uh, in this region, there's a lot of these packs have those those fallen trees within running distance. So as long as you can get to that, you're you're. I mean, it might take a while, but you're safe for the most part. Right, we're gonna see if I can actually find this exit. I remember I left the stick. I remember there was a fallen tree kind of pointing towards it. But what I don't remember is how actual far is it? not this tree I believe it's the next one maybe we'll see so we're gonna go through keepers pass because we really haven't been there we'll see about how long we're gonna spend there uh, I don't classify it as a actual region it's just a A zone you have to go through to allow everything else to load in, I guess. Alright, I think it's that one. I'm just gonna drop that. Wow, we didn't even uh, speed up at all. There, yeah, I think it's that one actually. There's my stick should be right up here. I don't know that that was my stick, but it might be. Yeah, we're going to go through there. Um, I guess I will move the sled as far as I can and then pick everything out of it. We won't be able to go too far. There's a big hill. I am anticipating we will get stymied by this hill. But who knows? Ooh. Yeah, okay, there it is. And we're absolutely stuck. Take you guys. Take you. We're not moving terribly slow either, you know? 
we're at 60. I think we drink and uh, eat. That'll help. A wee bit. And if we can stay out of the wind. I'm not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. Stay out of the wind would be all right. And yes, I know I left the, uh, the crampons. Those are just regular ones. We have improvised ones somewhere. I forget where. I would assume they're either Pleasant Valley Farmhouse or... Uh, would they actually be in Timberwolf Mountain at the Mountaineer's Hut? I don't think so, but maybe. I don't know. They're somewhere out there, though. One thing we still need to do, we, we do still need to go to Mountain Town and find uh, the bunny flask. I think it's a given, I think, that we're going to have to make another bow. Yes, the best flask. I still remember the first time we saw that bunny stuff it was in uh, when Hinterland briefly opened up their store. I wasn't actually as fond of it at the time because I thought, what the hell? Why do you have that? It's not even in the game. And then it was. <laughs> so now I like it a little bit more. Oh, I missed the truck. I don't know that the truck will have actually anything in it. But it's still a loot spot. Watch it, it'll have a battery. <laughs> Nothing. 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 Oh, you gotta check it, right? Gaining temperature, that's good. I can barely walk with this much gear. Yeah, I must check and get all the loots. <laughs> Why does the wind look like it's going left to right? Was it not going right to left out there? How is that pronunciation working? I, I read the word and say that's Sam Fain Ahobia. Ahobia? <laughs> Sam, Sam Hain Ahobia. But the pronunciation says Sawin Ahobia. Which means an abnormal or extreme fear of Halloween. I pity people that have that. It is fun times. It's not as fun anymore though. Maybe it's good for the kids, but the, like the, the, a lot of the kids these days, they, they go to specific places. Like, like malls or I think out here we have like a Halloween alley or something like that where they go. 
Not like the old days where you just went throughout your neighborhood with like a pillowcase. And then you'd come back and get another pillowcase. Why are you saying I'm lost? How do you know I'm not just exploring? Huh? What if I find something miraculous up here? Look at, there's a deer hide right there. Not that I knew that. <laughs> but there is, and we're gaining temperature. And I don't believe there's a rope or a rope. I don't believe that there's any wolves up here. So I'm just gonna do it with scent. Yeah, there's just a rope. I'm gonna look around the uh, climbing base to see if there's anything. Doesn't look like it, no. And where does this rope actually go to? Is it just a cave? Is it worth my while to climb down that rope? I could leave everything in the uh, travois up here. If there's possibly something nice down there. Uh, there's a small cave down below. Never found any worthwhile loot. And you have checked it in all of your runs. Alrighty then. Let's not bother. I, I think... I think a cave like that needs to have something good. Even if it's just like a cup of coffee or something like that. Just because of the, the pain of climbing down a rope like that and then climbing back. I think that's a fairly long rope too, isn't it? Like it's definitely not a shorty. Alright, that is the way out. I know that. Because when you come here, it's I always actually go that way accidentally. <laughs> I think I've only recently learned that when I do come here, I, I know that I'm going the wrong way when I go that way. Uh, cedar, fir, coal, maybe some jerky. Maybe a boost bar. Can be matches or a mag lens. That's actually not bad loot. We don't really need any of it, but... That would kill our day. If we went down there and came back up, we would be exhausted. And all just to get something that we basically just left a bunch of it behind <laughs> already anyways. Now we're minus one coffee. Ooh. Spooky swaying bridge. Don't say anything important in chat because my eyes are focused on the bridge. The Builder's Bridge. Uh, I think they failed building. There we go. I'd like to thank everybody in chat for 
being so obedient and not saying anything important. <laughs> Y'all didn't even say anything unimportant. That's how phenomenal you are. Hey. Oh, damn it, Murd. You need to remind me after stream to do that. You need to remind me. I'm not remembering. <laughs> I know, right? I'll accept that all caps comment. I will. I deserve it. But it, you know what? In my defense, you kind of know why now. I feel like we've been here before. I was actually uh, yesterday after stream. I was talking with the wife about how nerve wracking the weight was. I hadn't heard from that guy for two days. And then like, I don't know, after about 20 minutes of like some back and forth between us, my phone rang and I looked and it said what I wanted it to say. And a major relief moment happened. <laughs> Ooh, guess who's getting lucky? Darth. Darth's getting lucky. There you go. Do I have to, uh, what happens when I put you on my wheel? Where do you go? Because I did not like, that's where I was expecting you to be. I did not like you being way down over on the side like that. Cattails are life. Yeah, so remind me after stream to do it, and I will do it. I will switch that back to the other one. And I will have no excuses for not doing so. It would be like twice as loud. It'll scare Copper, and she's not even here. <laughs> Thanks for using it, by the way. I didn't actually say thank you. Yet. There you go. Thank you. I appreciate it. I wish tomorrow was like April 1st. Because I'd go in there and I'd change that to like 10,000. Without you looking. <laughs> I wouldn't tell you. I wouldn't do that. If only it worked that way, right? You just kind of go in and change prices of things with nobody knowing and they were never alerted to it. Uh, kind of like what everyone's doing to us, the consumers, by reducing the sizes of items that we're getting. Went to Bulk Barn the other day. I got like these little, I don't know, what do you call them? Like these little feet gummies. Oh, I love these things, right? And I swear I haven't had them like in over probably a year and a half. I swear they're literally half the size that they used to be. They're like, these are like baby feet. And they're ironically, they're called Bigfoot. <laughs> How are they big? They're barely as big as my thumb at this point. Ooh, that's another deer hide. I will crouch. I will take you. Ooh. 
We don't need the meat, but... One and a half. Why would you leave that? And we got this little sexy sapling over here. You need to get into my backpack. Oh, damn it. I took that other sapling with the intent of making uh, some more arrow shafts and I didn't. Oh, well. We'll make them somewhere else, I guess. If only you could stay in this house overnight without a fire. It's too bad. If you tried it, you would end up like this guy. What is that? Oh. I don't want your improvised hatchets. And... I don't want your spray paint. Yeah. Would it kill you to throw some flour out here somewhere? Closest bag of flour is probably 600 miles away. I don't know if it really is, but it may as well be. And I do still think that we should be able to take this. It would just be really difficult to use. I don't know, man. Maybe that is a good spot to stay. It's almost nighttime and we got sent two bars. And we got a bit of a walk ahead of us. Yeah, take that big saw and use it to fell a big old tree. There's so many things they could do with this game to make it even better. Like, you know how fun this game could be? Uh, let me rephrase that. You know how much more fun this game could be? My fingers feel numb. As much as I like the safe house customization, just the ability to build a shelter, right? Because now you have purpose. You got your sled that you can throw wood into. Uh, you can gather wood by cutting down trees. Fill up your sled, bring it back. You need the scrap metal to make nails. And you build a cabin. Somewhere. If I don't pour up soon. That would be amazing. But I'll be happy when I can just move a corpse. <laughs> I can just move a corpse out of the building I'm staying in. You'd build a cabin in HRV. Yeah. That would be a good place to put one. Um... I'm not gonna lie, I don't know exactly how far away from shelter I am. Excluding that cabin. So I'm not sure if I should be uh, lighting a fire or not. Maybe we're good right here. Maybe. Minus two. No. Not quite warm enough, but we do have a wicked uh, wind block. Oh, we don't have a wind block here. Okay, I take it back. Ah. 
not too far to the cave. Let's just carry on. I think we'll just, we'll lose a little condition, big deal. We'll gain it when we sleep. It is almost bedtime and we are almost at the, uh, the proper amount of alertness to be going to bed. I feel good when it's like somewhere under a quarter. And when that moon is like a little wee bit above the horizon. I think time wise that works out pretty good. It's a big old stone. Speaking of which, okay. Can you imagine walking through here and you're hearing a cougar? <laughs> Like, where? Where is it? Could be anywhere. Boom, it's on your head. The sun is setting. It's going to be a lot colder soon. Alright, we gotta be close by now. You know what's aggravating? The, my favorite hockey team has to play a game today. It's Halloween. Why would you do that? Why would you schedule any event aside from Halloween parties? Why would you schedule any sporting event or anything like that in a country that celebrates Halloween on the night of Halloween. Why would you do that? That is the dumbest, dumbest thing ever. There's my little rant. <laughs> Throw up the lights. Halloween scheduling rant. The only thing you should be scheduling on Halloween is a Halloween party. That's what I think. Oh, did Murd lie to us? We said it's not too far. Which sounds like it's closer than far. <laughs> there we go. I don't get to see those lights very often. Does that mean I'm doing good or does that mean y'all are slacking? One of the two. That means I'm doing good. Oh, okay. Nice. reclaimed wood to start a fire if I actually needed to start a fire so I'm not going to bother with picking up sticks. I think the cave is right up there. We are close now. You like this cave? Doesn't this cave have a rope in it? Hello. Hello, hide I don't need. And meat I don't need. There's 25 minutes. Oh, no rope. It's the ice cave. Okay. All right.
We're going to need to... Uh, this time I'm going to do it properly. I'm going to drink the herbal tea first and then top my bladder up with birch bark. Provided I have... I do have birch bark. And then in the morning, I'll finish that cup of birch bark. This pack is getting too heavy to carry. There you go. Um, let's light you up a wee bit. Come around the corner, there's a dog growling. Okay, I have to go up here and check because I remember way back, I don't even know if it's this one, but I remember way back, you used to find stuff on the ramps. I don't remember which ramps they were, so I check them all. <laughs> and we'll also go up that one. Nothing. It's actually good. I, I mean, we're so heavy. Oh, where do I go? This is where I needed. <laughs> this is where I needed sticks. Or does one of these lead to a dead end real quick? I don't remember. Yeah, XM's correct. Nifo is lost. And now I'm even loster. Hey, I'm gonna leave the flare. I don't need the flare. I will take the soda. You don't leave that around. I'm just laying around. Ah. ah. You know what? I'm gonna leave that one. Uh, I do remember. We only had, I think, one more use on our paint. I'm going back this way because this didn't lead me to a dead end, so maybe that will. But I think we will just stop right at this junction. Right, we came from there. And you go on the ground. There we go. And let's, uh, now that we got so much fuel, oh, look at that, uh, one and a half liters. Uh, we need to eat, try to dry ourselves out as much as possible. There we go. Now we can actually get a herbal tea and a birch bark. I think we'll get the whole birch bark. I think we did do that. Oh, I should have put that sapling on the floor. That way I could forget it. <laughs> all right. We got all our condition back. Uh, let's go. Oh, 29, 29. Where is it? Right there. 29. Do that. I think before I leave the cave, I should cook that meat. Right, which direction? This way? Yeah. Let's go this way. Watch, I'll find out this is instantly a dead end. Nope. What is our weight? 6001. Okay. Right, you are a dead end.
It's, it's weird for me to go through this cave right now. I don't know this cave very well, but I think nine out of ten times I'm coming the other direction. Oh, that's what I was looking for. This is a dead end. So when you're going like the opposite direction in a cave that you're mildly okay, mildly familiar with, it's uh, it's just like going through a cave you've never been through. This could be one of those caves where you really can't get lost, though, you know? I believe it's only got the two exits, right? Those other ones that have three or four exits, wow. Have fun with that. What do you mean I classified a path that wasn't a dead end, a dead end? Which one? Where? We've been there. The first one. Are you sure? Like that little nub of a cave? Or a path, I shouldn't call it a cave. It's not a cave all by itself. We'll see. We'll see. This almost feels like it's bringing us right back. <clears throat> The thing I don't like about this is that it reminds me of the HRV ice caves where you have sometimes a wolf. You're just a rock. Oh, you're a bandage. If I had gone straight, I would have gone to where I thought it was a dead end. Oh, okay. So, well, I didn't really miss any anything that way then, right? I just mistakenly called it a bad thing. I hate these caves. <laughs> I really hate these caves. I suck at these caves so bad. But this is good. This is good. Ooh, that'll dry us out real good. I will take the soup. I, you can keep your knife. Well, this stuff will come in handy. You keep it. Uh, let's go this way. I do got to stop at some point and make a fire. I just want to make sure. Yeah, we can... We can make a fire. Now we should probably do that right here. Uh, oh, damn it. I gotta use one of those. You know what I should have done? I should have used uh, accelerant and matches. Get rid of an accelerant, right? Perfect. Uh, 
Uh, you're one kilogram. You're one kilogram. You're 40 minutes. You're 33. Uh, what can we do? You're a half. I took a half for a reason, right? Uh, we have enough water. 383. We don't need to make uh, herbal tea. But we do, I wouldn't mind making one of these. We still have nine. We still have nine. Will this gain anything? What about you guys? That 1% you get automatically just by placing it on the ground is awesome. Because maybe one day you were waiting for that 1%. Uh, 20 minutes. We can't. I'm not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. Let's do that. We got enough time. Uh, do I have... Let's put you... And let's make... That. There we go. Let's go. I momentarily was very worried coming out of there thinking, uh oh, <laughs> this kind of looks like where we just entered. Luckily, it's not. Okay, I do think we can encounter wolves here. Typically up there. Oops. Oops. Oopsie schnoopsie. Should I take that hide as well? a stretch there's a guy over there I got everything I can get. Uh, we'll go up to the trailers. I gotta get my chair back in its proper spot. Uh, was there... You know what? Let's just go up to the trailers. Ditch some weight. Fight some wolves. Oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> that was close. This is a little too close. Uh, we'll ditch some weight and we'll come back. want to stay crouched but I'm not going to because it's way too slow yeah sometimes you want to do something but oh, good on you Astrid for squeezing by all right this is spooky this area Got little to no visibility because of the hill, and you know there's wolves. Gotta be more than two, right? There's one. Oh, dude, no. That was Merd. <laughs> I 
Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave the car. I'm gonna actually see. Am I warming up in here? No. Okay. Let's just leave the car. We'll get ourselves to the trailer. Uh, we can read the book for an hour, probably. Dump a bunch of weight. Come back. And do a good search and loot and call. I need to find some place to escape this cold. Don't worry, Astrid. I know a place. I gotcha. If you're lucky, there'll be a red toolbox in the trailer with the workbench there. Yeah, if we're lucky. I doubt it. I, I, hmm. I don't know if I would make arrows at this point with even a blue toolbox. If I was down to like six or seven arrows, I would use a blue one. But red is totally the way to go. So cold. I have scent, right? Yeah. We should go down there as well. Maybe not in today's game day. Maybe after we sleep, we will go check out that place. With these things. Just in case coach is out there only listening. Yeah. We shall see. At some point it's got to start working, right? At some point we got to start having some luck. It ain't going to get any higher unless we do it. I mean, I don't know even if there's any more books to read. We've been pretty much everywhere in the world. Is there really no more wolves? It was just those two. There's no bunnies either. Didn't we turn rabbit spawns to high? <laughs> In hopes that it was tied to the fish? And we don't even have bunnies. Alright, let's get in here. This pack is getting too heavy to carry. And we'll go in this one. Empty it. Alright, first things first. Um... You guys can all go there. You can go there. I'm going to drop these two just because. And I'm going to drop you guys too. It doesn't really matter, but I did it. Alright, what do we got that we don't need? We don't need any of these. That's all good. We can leave two of those. Uh... You guys can go in there. Let's do that. Forgot about that thing. <laughs> All right, uh, you can go. You guys can all go in here. I think. You. Where? There they are, arrow shafts. All 
All right. Uh, let's throw those in there as well. All right, let's uh, break down our arrow. Oh, rabbits are at medium. But we did raise them from what they normally were. Okay. Well, we got one of those. What are you at? 80. Nothing. And no red toolbox. Murd only said that. Knowing... There is no red toolbox chance. No? <laughs> Alright, is there... Give me coffee. Or give me nothing. Ooh, peaches. All right, we are basically warm at this point. Uh, eat that. Uh, I'm going to drop all of this food here, just in a big old pile. And what else? Those. We got eight bandages. How did we end up with eight? You have gotten a red toolbox here. There's a red toolbox. Somehow that one doesn't count. Ooh, we got a piece of fur. Let's take a stick. Battery. I don't want a battery, I'm just expecting because of how many we found. It's time. It's almost midday. We got, I think we have plenty. Oh, Jesus. That just scared the hell out of me. Where the hell did he come from? What the hell? Retreat. <laughs> Need some first aid. Did anybody know why? Number one, why is that stupid mask up top? Okay, we don't need you. We need. Why did I run out of these? Made you jump, made me jump too. Where was he when we were coming back? Like when we were coming here. There was no signs of any wolves. Well, luckily we had way too much cloth on us. Uh, you know what? While we're doing this, let's do that. Seventy-four. I got two. Damn it! I don't want to use my leather, but now those are at. I think the gloves can wait. Oh boy, that was ridiculous. Like seriously. That was not cool. There wasn't even like a, a, a hint of a wolf anywhere. And that guy just came out of the blue from God knows where. You got any buddies? Wow. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm not complaining about it. I'm just saying, I'm like, wow, I've never, never been attacked by a wolf in that fashion before. 
Oh, this is the, the water in two cloths region. Every car has a bottle of water and two pieces of cloth. That must have been one of those uh, going through the motions days at the office. Ooh, it says that energy bar. To be honest, that actually sounds like it takes away your energy, depletes it. I'm keeping this thing out because... I didn't have a chance of getting my bow out against that wolf. shocks you that the view from the scenic view isn't a vista <laughs> I thought I heard something oh, maybe I'm just hearing things See, that wolf can be out here, or it's usually in there, or I don't know. I mean, I've never encountered him coming from behind the trailer like that. But who knows? There he, there he lays. That's what you get. Don't frighten me. I'm gonna gather sticks. Uh, I'll come back around and go through that area. Oh yeah. Just like that. Okay, I'm going to take you out again. <laughs> I'm a little paranoid. What are we going to encounter down by the the water? Because I really, I was expecting more than two wolves. So did the game somehow just not spawn all the animals at the same time i don't know if i go down there and there's two more yeah technically there's three but down by the water i was expecting three or four because that area usually has three or four and then this area usually has one or two from my experience Wow, how many times can I miss that? Okay, let's go. Happened right there. Uh... 
Yeah, we're good. Ah, uh, nah, I'm not gonna. I was gonna maybe throw down the saplings, go back to the trailer, throw them down. But we'll get by without them. What's the time of day? It's mid afternoon, I guess, so that would be. I'm going to go this way. There, I don't believe there's anything that way aside from rose hips. Or potential rose hips because they're rose hip climbs. But I'm going this way because, like I said, there's usually three or four wolves up here. And two ain't going to cut it. Oh. <laughs> Copper comes in and scares me with a purr. Welcome in, Copper. How you doing? Nothing. This car didn't get the water and two pieces of cloth. I am good, Copper. How are you? I think I just asked you. Pretty good day, little pain. Okay, that's good. I made those crows come out. I summoned them. Oh, I don't see any more wolves. Aha! <laughs> Battery! Put you away. I'm gonna leave the battery. I don't care about it. But I'm going this way because I see the purple. Look at the purple. Oh, it's a big semi. That's what it is. A big old truck. I tried getting over that one time. I was unable. Let's go this way. I don't believe there's anything that way. I don't believe anyway. Ooh. Never know. Could end up being useful. Frozen peanut butter. Oh no. Well. We may not do any fishing, but we might. Who knows? Oh, jeez. Get out of there. Uh, I should be on this side. Try to get a wind block. Stay out of it. That is five batteries that we've found so far. Technically six because the game didn't give us a Mystery Lake battery. Uh, sorry, a Mountain Town battery. We had to drag one from far. Uh, can I stand please? Thank you. That was highly annoying. 
Uh, what is the temperature? Come on, let's do that. Uh, I wonder if we just throw the fur. Will we get? You know what else? We got a bunch of sticks. There we go. Let's do this and fish for a little bit. all my pots no fishing I'm fishing <laughs> I'm gonna do it come on game you're not helping your own self by not allowing me to catch any fish got two and now it's nighttime and we stink is this gonna stay lit if it blows out I'm just gonna chuck it because I don't really want a torch but I figured it would be safer We only have one bar of scent, though. Hmm. Yeah, so I wasn't thinking back there. Actually, back there. I dropped all my, my pots and my pan inside the locker. I wasn't actually anticipating coming out. Getting jumped. And using one of my birch barks. So, had I had one of those, or a can, I would have actually made another birch bark tea while we had a fire, but... Oh well. What is the wind? Minus 19. I'm surprised the sucker's still... Still lit. All it takes, though, is just one gust. One gust at the wrong time. And poof, you're in trouble. <sighs> Let's go this way so we can say we've been to all the little areas, I guess. Watch somebody at Hinterland have a really, really, really bad sense of humor and throw a moose on this little level. <laughs> that would be funny. I would laugh. Can we see our fire? Yeah, there it is. We were there. Still minus 19. What? Wasn't like 13 to 15, something like that? Wasn't that like the... When, when torches would burn out? Or sorry, blow out? Now it's like 19. Get in there, Astrid. There we go. We are good. And you know what we can do? Because we're amazing. We can... Harvest the burning torch. Alright, let's 
light this up drop these saplings uh we'll just contribute to the pile because we are gonna pick all of them up Okay, we have a bed. Uh, is it? Yeah, it's bedtime. All right. Uh, do we want to eat you? Well, first things first, we have enough room for it. I should not have drank. Yeah, I should have. That's the one I wanted, isn't it? 79. The other ones are better. Yeah. I want to drink you as well. There we got our tea and we got our other tea. There we go. And we'll fill the bladder and go to bed. Uh, just quick check. Make sure we didn't have any kind of afflictions. There we go. We are back to full condition. Uh, I'm going to eat all this dry food. I think we're done here, right? There's really nothing to do here. Aside from fishing and we saw how, how awesome that was. Two fish. Leave him behind. Uh, arrow shaft. 45 minutes with a hatchet. Eh. Oh, this is where I should have actually grabbed that improvised knife. You're five hours. Yeah. Is that actually a blizzard? Not quite. I was thinking, ooh, I could probably read that that book. We got five more hours on that. Let's go this way. We'll walk headfirst into the wind. I'm not going to grab any wood, like any sticks. Watch, you're going to have a battery too. <laughs> I was right. Let's go. Yeah, battery central. That what is that now? A six, six of seven if you count every battery that we found. But we did have to use one for mystery or uh, mystery uh, mountain town because they didn't give us one when they Jesus said that they cold. fixed that. Watch, well, when we go to mountain town, we'll find a battery now. And it'll be like in like painfully obvious spot. Like, wait, what? Do you have a bottle of water and two cloths? <laughs> yes, you do. Yeah. I'm just gonna say, you know, if, because I've seen the, I've seen the same thing in uh, 
stranded deep, right? Where every every island you go to will have two pieces of cloth within like five feet of each other. And I've said countless times that that game could be amazing if the developers weren't so lazy. And thank God for the modding community that that makes great maps. Yeah, you missed another battery. But I don't know if I was if I was the big guy and I saw that my one of my people put the exact same loot in several vehicles. I would lick my hand and give him a smack upside the head. And say we are better than that. That's just me. Because that just screams lazy. You couldn't pick a different item. That's all I have to say about that. <laughs> What did I call first? Oh, right. Yeah, I did. I, I said there's gonna watch there'll be a battery in here and there's like poof battery. I willed it to happen. Should we go this way and see if this bear is anywhere? Well, you know what we should do. Oh, go back to the road because we're getting a blizzard. Let's go right here. I only have one. I had three. Where did the other ones go? Where did I put them? Where did I leave them? Come on, little fire. All right, here's a cooked one. Near the point five. Near the one. Did I forget to grab my stuff out of the locker? Oh, damn it. I didn't put any coal on the fire. <laughs> I'm leaving this all here. Uh, I'm not wasting coal like that. I don't care. I'll, I'll lose condition. I don't know why I thought I went into the locker and grabbed all my stuff. It's you know what I did. I grabbed the stuff off of the floor and forgot everything that was in the locker. Oh, man. Well, the good news is I get to read my book. <laughs> when we get there. Well, at least I didn't make it all the way to the farmhouse. That would have been worse, but I mean, this is still fairly bad. No, I know I have a lot of stems. I don't want a stem because then it'll, uh, you know, when it wears off, we have no alertness. So on one hand, yeah, sure, we can get there quicker, but uh, I'm purely just guessing, by the way. The amount of condition that we have already lost, I think if we stim, we're going to get a bunch or at least half of that back. But then going through the rest of the day, being tired, 
we'll probably end up in the same spot condition wise get into my backpack not gonna be damn it for much longer. I wonder if I read my book for one hour to warm up I wonder if that fire will still be going let's go see shifted that's a good thing so it might you never know I don't know how long that fire was so we can't run because we're 58 um, we can eat some of this stuff help lighten our load I think 55, right? 10, 10 kilograms over capacity is is the cutoff for running, isn't it? Am I right or wrong? I'm probably wrong. <laughs> if it is 10, okay, good. I was right. I didn't know it, but I thought I was. And I hoped I was. There it is, Merd. Right there. Can barely walk with this much gear. We can't leave this here. Let's take this. I'm kidding. <laughs> Minus eight. Yeah, the blizzard's gone. If we... I don't know, man. It didn't take us terribly long to get... Back to the trailer. I don't know. I'd be very happy if that fire was still going. That explains why I didn't have uh, three of those. <laughs> I knew I had three. Figured I'd burn one to make the fire but when I saw I only had one I decided not to yeah oops whoops <laughs> pronouncing the I've been pronouncing the H in words a lot where the H is silent I can't feel my hands because it gets so little respect Imagine being a letter that makes up a word that nobody ever pronounces. You would probably wonder what your purpose in life is. This pack is getting too heavy to carry. I'm going this way purely to see if the fire is going. I don't know. Letter sympathy, yes. Hey, one day is judgment day and they're going to look at me like, yeah, yeah, you know, not the greatest person, but you weren't that bad. You sympathize with little bugs unless they were in your house. <laughs> then you killed them. But you had a law and you stuck to it. Yeah, pterodactyl. <laughs> I'll, I'll never understand why people put words, like why why they use letters and words that don't get sounded. I'm so cold. I'm warming up a bit. Is it there? Is it there? Is it where is it? Where is it? Uh, I'm not even. Oh, it's still way up there. Oh man. You have double standards with interior insects as well. Yeah. They can live in my house. I don't care. Just don't allow me to see you. Because once I see you, I must hunt you. Oh, 
Oh, you dirty bugger. I got a good mind to shoot you right now. I bet you one of my pieces of meat is missing. What other reason does he have to be over here? Where's my fire? Damn it. Well, there's the answer to that. Oh, he didn't take it. You are lucky. But you know what? Our fire worked so well right here. Do that. We don't have cockroaches here. I've never seen a live cockroach. A living one. Uh, <laughs> in one of the comedy books you read, an author makes fun of uh, silent letters and adds a P to the very name and item. <laughs> to, uh, to every name and item. I don't know. Very, very interesting. I don't want to burn you because you're one of them there, 0.5s. Hey, watch this. We can make him pace and then. Oh, it didn't work. I thought I, I, he must have turned naturally. Oh well. I thought I was doing something. Alright, let's take the birch bark. Uh, do I have anything I can make? We have that. <laughs> so P Terry and P John and P, P Fire, P T, P etc. Actually, we have a store called P etc. <laughs> he better watch himself. Hey, I got it all. Let's take it. I'm not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. Eh, shut up, Astrid. Quit leaving your stuff behind, dummy. I see you. Will he come right to my fire? Like, will I get him close enough? Come on, Astrid. He's... Oh, you dunce. Don't worry, when I make fun of Astrid, I'm actually making fun of myself. Okay, you wanna stand up? Two decades ago and he died of an illness seven years ago. He wrote like 70 books and was knighted. I feel that knighting somebody just cheapens the word, doesn't it? Remember like the old days where a knight was like actually somebody? And now it's like, yeah, that guy writes books, that guy writes songs. That guy was a drug addict, but he had that one really good song. He's a knight as well. None of them could fight. <laughs> like giving honorary degrees to uh, celebrities. I've never understood that. You got the money and you got the time. Go get an actual degree. Do they ever put that on their resume when they're applying for a, a role?
He made a proper knight's sword from a meteorite metal. Learned to smith. Had a trained blacksmith lead, but helped. Uh, that is actually kind of cool. My grandpa was a blacksmith. Like a real live. Hound and metal kind of blacksmith. I like blacksmiths. Is there even a bear over here? I don't know. Well, let's put that away. I mean, we have incredibly high visibility. We're walking around like we're paranoid. Oh, yesterday I went and bought some uh, work clothes because I didn't. I figured that you know I shouldn't wear sweats to this job, even though I wore them at my other one for like ten years. Um, I was gonna get these pants for work. Turned out they're like on sale, so they're like half of the price. I'm like yeah. But then I had to buy a belt and I was kind of disappointed because the belt costs more than the pants. Like how stupid is that? It's, leather, it's literally like a piece of leather with a... It, actually mine's not even a leather, it's one of those stretchy belts. But why does this thing cost more than the thing it's designed to hold up? I was going to get suspenders and I'm, I'm still not going to... Uh, not get them. I'm just gonna wait. I like the idea. And then you can loop your thumbs in them. <laughs> you get ratchet belts. That actually sounds kind of cool. I'm not a big belt person, but I think I now own like three. All right, now I will pull this out. But yeah, I was happy with the price because first I tried on, what were they? The first ones I tried on were Carhartt pants and they were like $89. I'm like, oh wow. But I didn't like how they felt. Then I tried on some Timberland pants, which were $80. And I like, yeah, I just, I don't like how these feel. And the wife came by and she's like, Hey, try these ones. I happened to look at the price and they're like 50 bucks. I tried them on. I'm like, actually, I like the way these ones feel. And then when we go up to the till, they're like, yeah, they're actually on sale for like ooh, freebie. They're on sale for like half off. <laughs> so then I like them even more. Oh boy, you scared the hell out of me. Doink. That's my barrow. You... Alright, I'm going to go in there and lose some weight and gain some scent. And come back here and whoop some butt. with this much gear do I have any wood I have two sticks okay I'm not dropping two sticks but I have some of you right why did why why that is pushing me against my will stop it all right we don't need you there they are there they are. Uh, we're going to drop you. We're going to drop you. Um, I'm not, I'm not doing like a full inventory management thing here. Uh, 
I'm just going to drop what I can where I can. And then we will go out hunting. Uh, what can go in here? I can't put that stuff. Okay, so I have I have one of each of those. I'm going to take a good one. Do I have others? No, I don't. Okay. Okay. Uh, food items. You're eaten partially. You guys can go there. Uh, peaches. See? I'm not eating all the peaches, Murd. I got some. Uh, dry food. You can go up here. You know what? You can go right there and then I'm going to stick this right underneath it. These will be sold individually or as a pair. I don't care. It's however you want it. Uh, throw you down somewhere. Do that. We don't need these at the moment. Uh, how heavy are we? 50. Uh, you. I'm going to make a pile of stuff here. That hopefully I won't have much issue picking back up. There we go. That should be fine. We'll check our scent when we get outside. Drop any of this gear. One. That looks horrible. <laughs> that looks nasty. That's like... Ew. Can I rotate it? Actually, no, not that way. Ew. What about you? You look worse. Okay, where's the meat? We'll take wolf meat. They can smell their own better than they can smell anything else. Don't take my word for it. It's not like a game thing. Just a me thing. Alright. Calling everything with teeth. We have a meat. Actually, I should... Ooh, a meat. Get it? Drop the hides. Yes, I just thought of that before I looked over. I should drop the hides. Let's put the let's put that away. We have oh so many. Actually, I just don't have as many as I thought I had. Oh, well, we have eight. And. We have some maple. You're a maple. You're a maple. And this pack is getting kind of heavy. And the birch, three of them. There we go. We, we we do have a red toolbox, right? Yeah, I can see it. You know what? Don't let me forget this. As, as hilarious as it would be. Uh, 20 arrow shafts. Let's leave all that in there. Uh, I also don't need... I don't, I'm not entirely sure why I took the guts. But I did. Alright. Where's the puppies? I called the meeting. And they are not. 
listening. It's a nice sunny day. Let's go get some birch bark. I wonder if that bear is out. The birch bear. Uh, I'm going to go across the bridge. That way I'm not going down a hill and then back up a hill. I just go what I feel is a safer route. I'm going to keep the bow out because I'm going to take a sip of my coffee. This road's a little further out than I was actually thinking it was. Oh great, I still have a hill. So it doesn't really matter, is that a bunny? It is a bunny. Is that the bear? That is a bear. Hey, copper. Where's the bear? There's the bear. He's smelling us. That's why he's coming this way. So I'm just going to go over here and sit by the trailer and wait. And hopefully another one comes. I'm still itching to get two bears in front of the farmhouse. Like laying there. The closest I've ever had was one in front laying down. And one in front running away with an arrow. Uh, I should wait up for a slow poke. There he is. He's still coming. He's right there. Right there. He's coming. This is where the other bear appears in Clever Girls here, right? <laughs> <clears throat> We have an equivalent to holy hand grenades. They always blow my fingers off. Thanks for that, Merd. <laughs> Copper likes that one. Three bars. Come on, little bear. What's the time? It's almost nighttime. Oh boy, this guy might turn into a green bear. Depending on when he gets here. Is this safe? I don't know if this is safe, but... I don't know. He... he, he He's still coming this way. Do they even scare the bear off? The hand blowing off grenades. I... I don't know. I could try it, but it kind of... Goes against what I'm trying to do. Because with my luck, it would work. <laughs> And we're like, oh, great. Now we gotta wait for another bear. We got good wind, too. That's 17. We got three bars of scent. That should be pulling every predator. Some might just be entering via the transition zones, but... I wish we could climb the silo and just snipe them. 
from up there. He's coming. I think he veered off to this, uh, to the side because he wants to glitch through the cabin. I had one literally walk right through this part of the cabin. That might be a good spot for him right there, eh? Or do I want him closer to that door? My problem is if I wait too long... Oh, son of a bugger. The terrain. I thought he was done. I thought he was done. Oh, that's my bear. That's bear 29. Uh, I thought he was done shifting his uh, movement when I shot and his head dipped and I got him in the back. I'm calling that a massive failure because now where worst shall he be? Oh, and his footprints just disappeared. That's not fair. How come whilst is a word, but worst isn't? Come on, people who invented the English language. There he is. Oh, he's going home. That's where he looks like he's going. Nope, not no more. He's not. You're right. That isn't the birch forest bear. That guy came from way down there. So that's that bear. That one way over there that we thought we didn't have. Can I maybe get two bears at the uh, barn? Possibly. Yeah, what's <laughs> or housed? Did, is that him? Did he just go down? Yes, he did. We got twenty nine. Well, he would have lived longer if somebody would have explained to him, like, hey, when you're injured like that, exerting yourself, such as running, will only make you bleed faster. Maybe that's what he wanted, though. Maybe he's like, damn, that arrow hurts. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> I didn't even see him. Where's he going? Okay. You just saw what I did to a bear. I will do it to you. Is that another one? Nope. Well, I'm looking for wolves now because there should be a bunch of wolves out here. Oh, seriously, it's like a dream I've I've always had in this game. Is there's a wolf. 
is to have two bears down side by side or at least close enough to be in the same screenshot it's not even very cold it's only minus one I wonder if another bear was to come if I crouched and went inside of this bear's body are you able to get attacked I'll take that that is mine is it only moose that you can do that too where you can get inside their body Oh, where is it? Where did that wolf go? At some point he will come back. Uh, it's also a very good bet that this bear might not be up yet. What's the time of day? It's almost nighttime. Well. There's only one way to find out if this guy's up, and that's to go have a look. I'm trying to... Where are you? You're like basically straight out from there. It'd be so embarrassing to come back in the morning and like, I have no idea where the bear is. I'm not seeing a bear and minus 18 on the wind three bars of scent this guy should be outside I mean unless he's still walking that way towards where he smelt us originally Casually looking for birch bark as well. Uh, why not? Let's take some sticks too. Let's put you away. We don't need that. We got one. There's number two. Where's the bar? Where is he? Where is your owner? I don't want to eat any of that meat because I don't want to give up my three bars of scent. But I also don't want my stomach growling like that. Yeah, I'm going to say that this bear is not up yet. Where did I lose you? Oh, I'm not going to complain. I'll take it. Random arrow, yes. Oh, we're going to get an Aurora. You know it. It is way too clear. Damn it. I didn't want to find that. Okay, there. Good. Found another one. I believe that puts us at uh, six. There we go. Right, where's that wolf? Why did that wolf not come out this way? Ooh, look at that. It's like the mountaintops are burning. 
like a volcano. You love finding random arrows. I know. Anybody that doesn't like finding random arrows shouldn't even be playing this game. But why... Why is there a random arrow there? I mean, obviously something I shot must have died in there and... But I don't recall shooting anything. I don't know. Okay. Well, it's not as impressive, but... We can put a wolf by the bear. I think this wolf was trying to ambush me. Shoot you from the bear. <laughs> Right there. There you go. It's like a twisted chase. <laughs> we'll configure their bodies so it looks like the bear is chasing the wolf. What is that thing? Let's go have a look. Oh, is it just the end of one of these? Which, yeah, that's what it is. Okay. Well. We've got a bear out here. Um, honestly, I'm going to go back to the farmhouse. The reason is because we still have three bars of scent. And... Who knows? Maybe the other bear has finally decided to join us. Feels like night is coming. Go this way. I need to find a place to rest. I don't see any other predators anywhere. Maybe it'll be a green bear. Maybe. That's not the music I was expecting to hear right away. But we're... Just those guys. Hey! <laughs> what the hell? That's two arrows I found. I'm not complaining by any means. But have I just found my missing two arrows in this region? Pretty sky. It is. Hey, buck. Big, fat, juicy buck. And we run. Like, I always thought if, if animals ran off with your arrow, your arrow, and, <clears throat> and you didn't find them, eventually you would find your arrow where that animal died and despawned but I don't think either of those arrows are in places that uh, an animal just died and despawned the one by the fire could be remember I got that bear I think it was the bear I got and I, I yeah, I didn't feel like I got all my arrows out of him. It could be that one broke and he was on top of it. Which is why it was right beside the fire. 
But the other one, I have no clue. I want to go to every other region where I'm missing arrows. And see if I can get them all back. Bring them all home to daddy. <laughs> all right. Well, let's get inside, I guess. Uh, we have cooked meat. We got our butt hanging out the door so we can still get attacked technically. Uh, just to be safe, I'm going to drop all of that uh, wolf meat. I don't want to accidentally eat any of it. And you're a point five. Uh, do I have a point five little pile in here? Oh, I may not because I think I cooked them. What's the time? Uh, let's do that. Do that. And... Let's do that. We'll make a carry pie. Whilst we can. Come on, little fire. Alright, nine minutes ain't gonna cut it. I think it's 45 minutes or something, is it? Uh, venison pie. 56 minutes. It's an odd time. That actually... You're 43, but you're just ever so slightly behind it um, think I can get a bed to go down somewhere in here I don't think so oh don't I already have a mattress down a mattress a bedroll yeah I have one all right what are you you're cooked making sure um oh it's too oh i don't need water i have a bunch where am i oh wow there's the bedroll um drink one of those and fill up the bladder that's a ruined... Oh, it is. But it says I can still sleep on it. Well. Yeah. I'm going to give her a go. So, for those of you on YouTube, if you like what you saw, please like and subscribe. And I will see you all tomorrow.